phrase often spoken with curiosity and disbelief, humans evolved from apes. It paints a simple linear picture as if one day an ancient chimpanzee simply stood up shed its fur walked off to build a city. This idea has captured our imagination for generations sparking debate and wonder. It seems to place us at the end of a long line of familiar hairy ancestors. But is that the whole truth? The reality as uncovered by science is far more intricate. And more magnificent. It's not direct descent but a shared, distant family. The idea can be unsettling. Looking into the intelligent eyes of a gorilla or an orangutan we feel something familiar. Imagine a great, ancient river of life flowing through time. Millions of years ago the river forked. One stream branched off flowed through different valleys and terrains and became the line leading to modern chimpanzees bonobos. The other stream took a different course carving a unique path, our line. Through countless generations of adaptation it led to us. So, we did not evolve from the apes we see today. We and the apes evolved from a common ancestor. We are evolutionary cousins, not their children. The most tangible evidence comes from fossils, the mineralized remains of ancient life. Paleontologists have unearthed a remarkable collection of hominin skulls, skeletons and footprints from across Africa and beyond. These fossils when arranged by age show a clear and gradual transition over millions of years. We can see skulls slowly becoming rounder brain cases expanding and faces flattening but the evidence goes far deeper than bone. It is woven into our very DNA, the biological instruction manual found inside every one of our cells. When scientists compare the human genome with that of our closest living relatives, the chimpanzees and bonobos, they find an astonishing degree of similarity. Our DNA is roughly 98.8% identical to theirs. This is irrefutable proof of a recent common ancestor. Beyond fossils and genes the evidence of our shared ancestry is present in our own anatomy. Look at the bones in your hand. You have a wrist, a palm and five fingers. A chimpanzee has the same fundamental structure as does a gorilla. Even seemingly useless features known as vestigial structures tell a story. Have you ever had goosebumps? Our tailbone or coccyx is another powerful example. It is the remnant of a tail that our distant primate ancestors used for balance. When we hold up the mirror of nature compare ourselves to our ape cousins, the family resemblance is undeniable. Both humans and other great apes are intensely social creatures. We form complex societies with hierarchies, friendships, rivalries. The capacity for tool use is another remarkable bridge between our worlds. Chimpanzees in the wild have been observed using sticks to fish for termites, stones to crack open nuts leaves as sponges to soak up drinking water. These actions demonstrate not just instinct but forethought learning and the cultural transmission of knowledge from one generation to the next. However, for all our similarities the differences are just as profound and are what truly define our species. The most obvious is our bipedalism, our commitment to walking on two legs. This single evolutionary shift freed our hands allowing them to become the most exquisite tools of creation and manipulation in the animal kingdom. This in turn is linked to the development of our extraordinary brain. While a chimpanzee's brain is impressive, the human brain is about three times larger, with a massively expanded cerebral cortex. This cognitive gulf is what truly sets us apart. We don't just communicate about the here and now, we tell stories about the past and make elaborate plans for the future. We build vast, interconnected societies based not on instinct but on shared beliefs, laws, cultures. We investigate the cosmos, compose symphonies and ponder the meaning of our own existence. While our ape relatives live rich and complex lives, the human experience is one of cumulative culture and symbolic thought on a scale that is entirely new to this planet. We are the ape that learned to question everything and in doing so we changed the world. Understanding our evolutionary journey is more than just an academic exercise, it is fundamental to understanding ourselves. It provides the ultimate context for who we are, explaining the origins of our bodies, our minds many of our most basic behaviors. Knowing that our anxieties have roots in ancient survival instincts, or that our need for social connection is a deep-seated primate trait, can provide us with profound insight. It helps us to see ourselves not as flawed or broken beings, but as the product of an epic story of survival and adaptation, a biological marvel shaped by the deep history of our planet. When we realize that the chimpanzee, the gorilla and the orangutan are not lesser beings, but our closest living relatives, our perspective must shift. They are not curiosities for our entertainment, they are family. This understanding carries with it a profound ethical responsibility. These magnificent creatures, 
with whom we share so much history, are critically endangered, largely due to the actions of our own species. Recognizing our kinship compels us to act as stewards, to protect them and the precious habitats they depend upon for their very survival. Furthermore, the principles of evolution are the bedrock of modern biology and medicine. Understanding how species change over time helps us to fight diseases. Viruses and bacteria evolve rapidly, and by applying evolutionary principles we can predict their changes and develop more effective vaccines and treatments. It allows us to understand the genetic basis for many human diseases and to trace the migration patterns of our ancestors across the globe. Our evolutionary past is not just a story, it is a practical tool that helps us to build a healthier and more knowledgeable future for all of humanity. Ultimately, the story of our evolution is a unifying one. It transcends all the cultural, national, and ethnic divisions we have created. Beneath the surface, we are all members of one species, Homo sapiens, with a shared African origin. Our story is one of incredible resilience of a small, vulnerable primate that learned to cooperate, innovate, explore its way across an entire planet. It is a story that should fill us not with arrogance but with wonder and a deep appreciation for the long, improbable journey that led to this very moment. It is the greatest story ever told, and it belongs to every single one of us. If this incredible journey of human evolution has amazed you as much as it has amazed me, please give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to our channel for more fascinating explorations of science and human history, and share this video with friends and family who might be curious about our remarkable evolutionary story. Together, we can spread the wonder of scientific discovery.